Welcome everybody to Rapture Watch for Friday the 29th of May 2020. Watchman the Wall William from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, and I hope all of you guys are having a blessed day of the Lord. And uh, today I want to uh, make something abundantly clear. I don't know if uh, there was a uh, miscommunication of some kind or just uh, a, a lot of new people, but um, I got some comments uh, about um, being clear on my position and uh, I'm going to make it very clear that I am a pre-tribulation, pre-millennial uh, believer and the word of God is what I go by, not my opinion, not my feelings and not by what other uh, men say, it's the scripture and also God's character. Uh, Jesus is the same today as he's always been, and in the Father are one, and the Lord never changes, and he always takes his people out before judgment. And so he has promised us, he's preparing a place for us, and where he goes, he's going to come and receive us unto himself. And so um, I want to back up some things here as well because I was getting uh, told to uh, stop doing rapture uh, messages because um, I'm lying to people and uh, that is not true. Matthew uh, 24, 43, Jesus uh, talks about uh, if know this, if the good man of the house had known in uh, the watch uh, what the thief would come, he would have watched and would have not suffered his house to be broken up. Therefore, be ready also, for in such an hour you think not the Son of Man cometh. See, the Lord is telling us over and over, we are not going to know the day or the hour, but we are to watch. And we are to edify one another and build each other up, not tear each other down. And so I want to read uh, 1 Thessalonians, always get that tongue twisted, uh, chapter 5. But of the times and the seasons, brethren, ye have no need that I write unto you. For yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night. For when they shall say peace and safety, sudden destruction cometh upon them, as travail upon a woman with a child, and they shall not escape. They shall not escape. But ye, brethren, are not in darkness, that that day should overtake you as a thief. Ye are children of light and children of the day. We are not of the night nor of darkness. Therefore, let us not sleep as others do, but let us watch and be sober. For they that sleep, sleep at night, and they that are be drunken, are drunken in the night. But let us, who are of the day, be sober, putting on the breastplate of faith and love, and for a helmet of hope and of salvation. For God has not appointed us to wrath, but to obtain salvation by our Lord Jesus Christ, who died for us, that we, whether wake or sleep, we should live together with him. Wherefore, comfort yourselves together and edify one another, even also ye do. So, this is another scripture that perfectly tells us that uh, we are to edify one another as we watch, as we see the day approaching we're to be building each other up strengthening each other and um, any kind of um, discord being sown amongst brethren any kind of uh, uh, slanderous um, libelous things that you can uh, do is is not edifying you know it is uh, it's tearing down and it's an abomination to the Lord it's one of the seven things he hates okay a lying tongue 
uh, hands that are quick to mischief and uh, um, just we know that God hates uh, those who sow discord and who are trying to um, prevent people from telling the truth and sharing the word and that's all I do here as I share the word and um, and try and build up as much as possible and um, you know as many of you longtime people know my health situation and, and stuff it's uh, it's it's not easy there's been a lot of challenges and so um, you know this gives me strength this uh, you know I don't I don't do this for financial gain I do not ask for money I do this purely out of a love offering to the Lord and to help edify you guys because that's part of the, the great commandments is to love God with all your heart soul mind and strength and love others as yourself so you know we have to start um, you know doing better you know I know that we're under a lot of pressure right now there's a lot of uh, you know pent up aggression and um, you know it's uh, it's not good to um, fight amongst each other and it's not good to show other people who are seeking the Lord this kind of nonsense because it's um, it's very um, off-putting, you know. But uh, for you guys who are still listening, obviously, um, you're not uh, part of that group because a lot of the times these people they don't even listen to the video; they just blast whatever uh, they want to say and. Um, you know, it's crazy because when you start going in and writing crazy stuff halfway through the, your tirade, I'm just going to delete the comment. So it's just a complete waste of time and energy, um, you know, trying to attack or put false things out there. You know, it's going to be deleted. Um Anyways, um, yeah, I wish I had a more positive uh, message for you, but um, I did have a, a burr under my butt on this one and um, wanted to share that and uh, say that even though, um, you know, I, I feel offended-ish about it, um, I still want to pray for all those people who are in that situation because at the end of the day we don't know what the people are going through and um, just like they don't know what, what you and I are going through and so we pray for them and we pray for deliverance for them to get out of that situation or, or whatever is happening um, that's causing them to have these outbursts and, and whatnot so um, nobody's perfect that's the whole point and you know we're in this together so thank you guys for listening uh, to another video I have uh, a very new and interesting thing I'm going to uh, share with some of you guys who um, listen to the video all the way to the end I will uh, put a special link in either this video or the next one uh, to a new um, special project that uh, is something that's very important to me and I hope you guys like it so um, that's going to do it for today if I don't see you in the clouds tonight I'll have another message for you very soon peace be with you